Okay guys, we're gonna do a compressor change out along with a fan motor on a 17 year old heat pump up in Placerville. So, um, it took me quite a while to figure out this call. When I went out and did the service call on it, the electrical breaker kept tripping, which made me think, shorted to ground. And uh, I checked the fan motor, I checked the compressor, and I could not find any evidence that the compressor was shorted to ground, at least through my meter. When I unplugged all the wires from the compressor and just turned the breaker on with a call for AC, with, uh, with no call for AC, the, fan the outdoor fan motor would turn on and run. So apparently it was getting 120 volts to it. And then, uh, and then if you turn the breaker on, or if you, I'm sorry, if you turn the uh, call for AC on, it would stop. It tripped the breaker. At the same time, if we removed all the wires from the fan and just wired up the compressor, as soon as you flipped on the breaker, and then go push the contactor, it would trip. The breaker would trip. So, I was out there probably about two hours on that service call trying to figure it out. And we're going to change this compressor out. We're going to change the fan motor out. Uh, and uh, let's, uh, let's see what happens, okay? Cool. All right.
I did a startup and um, pressures and 407C started just started shooting up through the roof and I started up in cool and my suction pressure was really low so um, I started doing some looking around and basically looking for restriction in airflow and sure enough I found it so that's probably what killed this compressor in the first place uh, and took the fan motor out with it sit here and run it in heat and see hopefully it seems to be stabilized right now and we're going to turn it back to AC and see if my suction pressure comes up better so okay okay guys well we got that system up and running um, change the compressor change the fan motor wired it all up and We dropped the 407C in there, so so that was my first time running with 407C. I um, charged the system up to factory specs on the outdoor coil and the liquid line and the, the refrigerant lines were, you know, pretty short. Uh, in fact, I'd say probably about 15 feet. Um, so I charged it up to five pounds nine ounces like the label said on for r22 and cooling the um, suction line suction side was really low and uh, then when I fired up in heat the liquid line started spiking like way high like 400 like 400 psi so so I um, it kind of made me think that there was some sort of restriction going on so I went in and checked out all the filters and sh lo and behold I found that one filter that I showed you guys uh, earlier found that filter took it out ended up having to re still remove some refrigerant from the system because I had a little bit too much in there that brought my pressures down to about 280 or so in uh, heat on the liquid line uh, and then I flipped it back on in cooling and I still had a good 20 degree split from there so um, so heating was good cooling was good I feel good being able to leave right now go home enjoying the nice town of Placerville old hang town some of you guys uh, ask me uh, why do I, or what's the mother load? The mother load is the uh, the highest gold bearing region of the great gold rush here in Northern California, just outside of Sacramento. Well, we're up here in Placerville right now. Placerville is a small little town. They call it Old Hangtown. This was the last city in California with the death penalty rule, the death penalty law where they could hang people. There's a bar coming up here on the right. I don't think it's open anymore, but there's a there's a, a storefront up here on the right. And uh, they talk about or they they the guy's got a See, it's up here on the right but I think somebody stole it again but there's a dude hanging from the hanging from the ceiling up here there he is up there on the right hangman's tree yeah I guess that dummy's been been stolen a few times and the city's just tired of it it's kind of a you know uh, you know endearing uh, article of the city but somebody keeps taking it so now they're just not wanting to put it back up anymore that's Placerville alright guys well I'm gonna head on home I appreciate you guys uh, staying along
there's the rain. Oh, there's the rain. It just hit. So lucky. So lucky to miss that. 